I guess we'll go this way. Oh! Wow, you were really dead. Like, you are supremely dead, dude. Oh my god. I. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Um. Jesus. Uh, we're gonna use mace because. Our shield is going to protect us from a few hits, I hope. Going to crush your skull! Alright, that didn't hurt you at all. That's kind of fucking... Ah! Going to beat your motherfucking ass! Going to take you down to the fire. Uh. No, no, no. Ah, damn it. Fucking shit. Why? Why must you suck, Mace? Son of a bitch. <laughs> he moves too fast. I can't cast magic! I guess I just have to beat him. Bam! Gonna be trolling you! I'm literally trolling him with the mace. Like, lol! Oh man, is that the end of our fun time? Ooh, that looks kind of painful. Sorry, dude. Are you okay? He's not dead yet. Wait, does he just keep coming back to life? Because if so, that's not good. I think I'll set him on fire. What? Okay, that didn't set him on fire. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Is there anything in here for me to take? I don't think there's anything in here for me to take. I'm gonna look around anyway though. He's just like, damn it, slow down! Fucking humans and their two working ankles. Yeah, we're just gonna ignore you for now, Charlemagne. I mean, not Charlemagne. Antonio. I think his name was Antonio. We're just gonna go this way. Sorry to bother you, sir. I, I'm not sure if he keeps respawning or if there's a certain way to defeat him, but I'm just gonna assume he keeps respawning. Whoa! Hey, what? Get over here. Hey, hey. Get over here. Hey. No. Get back. You're not even gonna you're not even gonna get one strike. Ow. Damn it. Get shit. Stop it. You're 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 a bad bone thief. Bad bone thief. Fucking you're you're bad. You're bad! Die! Anyway. Sheet of music. Huh. Alright, so we have a sheet of music. That's interesting. We will there you go, we have books. Huh. Interesting. Hmm. Easel is a sheet of tattered paper covered in scrolls of ink. Diary page. Alrighty. Page two. I suppose it's understandable that they will not show me the hand of Jude on such little notice. But I must confess that the preparations they are making are not uh, are most unusual. No act of consecration, no daily prayer or worship are demonstrated by this order by this strange order. One wonders if they are holy at all, let alone being under the aspens of the Grand Inquisition. Perhaps it is my naivete of our faith. There are many practices associated with it, and they differ greatly from region to region. Perhaps Amiens is merely more eccentric than others. So, a lot, everyone pretty much agrees that this place is weird. But they're they're okay with it because they're pretty much going with the excuse of, eh, maybe they just do things differently here. Which is pretty reasonable, I think. But, at a certain point, you gotta say, you know, I've had enough of this shit. Erase 
way of books. Bewildinger. Yeah, okay. Alright, yeah. Excuse me. Well, there's bookshelves here now, so that's cool. Hmm. Why do I get the feeling that this bookshelf moves backwards? Maybe I'm just crazy. Anyway, we have the sheet music, so that should help. <laughs> We're just gonna ignore that infinitely respawning zombie back there. Cause, I mean... Nobody really wants to talk about him! <laughs> oh, God. Alright. Piece of some yuzu is somewhat tattered, probably through years of use. It's beyond the control of the mind. Wait, what? I mean, bellow and pump the pipe organ is uh, able to play deeply moving, moving music. It has the power to inspire faith in the influence heart beyond the control of the mind. That's kind of bad, but okay. A, B, Y, X, B, Y, A. Oh shit, we got some Castlevania music going on here. Oh shit. Oh my glob. We just found... Well, apparently Castlevania's trigger, but... We also found the next stage in our powerful magicka. We will be immortal. The turbinacle is almost empty. There's none of the things that should be here, such as the holy water and other ritualistic items. Only a circle of power lying on the lower shelf. There are no other shelves. But we're picking it up because this gains us access to so much power! I'm just like electrocuting. Just oh, 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 oh. This acquired the five point circle of power. Now, each of the three point spells can be powered up by using the power rune. You guys know what that means, don't you? Well, you better. Because if you don't, then it's kind of awkward. Basically, all of our spells can be made more powerful now. And we should probably do that. Let's get, let's get a look at our quick spell. Enchant item. Yeah, that could stand to be more powerful. Enchant item. Wait, what? Oh, no, do we have to create them? Oh, man, we have to create them. That's both cool and kind of time consuming. So, alright. Well, let's check this real quick. Alright, so. It requires Antibark and Morgormar. Alright, so. Magormar. Antibark. Antibark. And Magormar. Where's Magormar? There it is. Mantarok, TR, Nathalak. Antibark. Magormar. Redgamore, Athlag, Santac. Alright, so we don't have Paragon yet, but basically, the way I've seen most people do it is after you get the, the things you need for the spell in there, you just fill out the rest with pretty much anything. At least, that's how I understand it, so... Does that work? Does that not work? Oh, maybe we can't until we get... Oh, that's so evil. You are so mean, game. Oh, I don't think we can until we get Paragon. Par Paragon. Oh, that's so... Alright, so the game's trolling me right now. But that's okay. We'll get it. We'll get that shit. We'll get it shit. Um, where do we go now? Do we have anything? We have a mace, a sapphire, sheet music, and a torch. Not really. I'm going to get that torch out, actually. So we can see.
Man, Dracula would be proud. He would be proud of that shit. I don't care what anyone else says. Um, nah. Let's keep looking, because apparently we're looking for a... I want to say Topaz? I don't know. You'll never see this evil coming. <laughs> They're just playing a really ass evil song on the organ. And everyone's just like, man, that sure does sound evil. Good thing these guys are holy men, right? <laughs> like, no one fucking cares. Ugh. Oh, oh. Oh, we're looking for a red ruby. Okay. So, colored gems fill two in. All right, yeah. So we're looking for a ruby now. We haven't seen one yet, so I assume it's somewhere we haven't looked. Which makes sense. <laughs> um, I guess we'll go back upstairs. Since we already looked in the old tower, let's check one of the other places. See if we can find Pargon! Which I think is... I think it's just a space filler rune and you have to have it for more powerful magic. I may be wrong, but I think that's what it is. Alright, so there's nothing in there. Pretty much. Nothing. Let's go back to the thing, see if that guy is there. Maybe he wants to talk to us about how awesome we are and how effectively we've saved the universe. Because we've obviously saved the world, right? What, we haven't? We played some fucking organ music! That's got to be worthy of some saving the world. Mm -hmm. We're going this way. He's just like, man, I'm old. Oh, it hurts to run this hard. <laughs> man, we'd have kids boogieing down to this shit if we were having mass right now. Of course, they'd probably all be sacrifices, but you know, that's just how it is these days. Custodian shakes his head and informs Paul that he doesn't have any evidence to... Okay. Um... Wow, I think I may be kind of lost now. Shit. Well, I'm going to take a second to look around, see if I can find anything to do. Be right back. Oh, okay. So there is a... He wasn't just... Oh, man, I feel stupid. All he did was fall down last time. stupid there. <laughs> he fell down last time and I assume he regenerated, man. That was dumb. But I found what I was looking for. And what I wasn't looking for is a two-handed sword. That's pretty kick-ass. Is his body gonna get back up? Because, I mean, we have a two-handed sword now. Aw. I guess he doesn't want to play. Boo-hoo. Alrighty, sorry about that. Um... Got a little bit of interruption there, but, um... Oh, man, I forgot I left that thing. <laughs> apparently, I was trying to figure out if I could get past something, but, um... Apparently, if you, uh... If you summon a trapper and you release it, it becomes wild and attacks you. I didn't know that. gonna slice you in the head because fuck that I don't wanna uh, nope nope quit it quit it just and now you have no limbs whatever shall you do 
Like, he's just, like, standing there, like, man, if I had limbs, I would beat the shit out of you. And I'm just like, ah, I ain't afraid of you. I ain't afraid of you or your demon magic. But, we know where we're supposed to go now. Which is good, because I didn't before. And for some reason, the organ music stopped. I didn't know if it was on a timer or if I glitched it out or something. I don't know. But hey, I'm alright with not total Castlevania music the entire time. He's just like, God, I'm so fucking tired. Alright, so... Before we do that, I want to do this. Shatterga! Give me your magic! Na 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 na. Zelatar. And we have us a shield. And we're gonna summon. And there we go. And now we're gonna save. Because we'll be calling it right after we put the final slot in the final hole. If you know what I mean. Yep. Alright, so we're gonna put the tiny little ruby. Get over here, ruby. And. Wow, that was surprisingly ghostly. <laughs> and we dive deeper into the catacombic chambers of this world. Na 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 na. Oh man, you were a zombie. How you doing? not afraid of you, zombie. In fact, I'm just... Man, this guy is just brutal. He's like, man, I gotta... I gotta beat it out of them. They, they think they can take me. I gotta beat them into submission. Yeah! Urgh! Take it! They love taking it. On the bright side, though, he always makes sure his enemy is dead. That's an odd, ad admirable trait. I know some people from a lot of places could benefit from that. Namely, TV shows I've seen. And they busy. But, you know. That way we could... Lost the first hint of my shields. But that's okay, because I'm slicing these guys up, and they don't stand a chance. Bam! Got us a magic rune. If that's the one I'm thinking it is, I think it is too, because there's not many left. Yes! We have Pargon! And I think we'll get to see Five Point Magic after this. But, since we've been going for a while now, it's time to call it. I've been your host, Lucas13. It's been great being here, and I hope you've enjoyed these parts of Let's Play. Eternal Darkness, Sanity's Requiem. I was trying to make a rhyme, but fuck, that's harder than I thought. But anyway, <laughs> I think that, let's, let's check it out, actually. Runes. Oh, we don't have the thing yet, but I bet it's Pargon. It has to be Pargon, that's the only one left. Anyway, I've been your host, Lucas13. I hope you'll join me next time. And um, we'll probably do something with Minor Cameo. And then more dark, our Eternal Darkness. Um... Tell me what you want. Tell me what you need. I'll be here all day and night, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. And, oh, and get ready for some, uh, for some, uh, shit, what was I going to say? Get ready for Pokemon to end. And we're probably going to start up Paper Mario, uh, Thousand Year Door after that. Maybe so. Not sure. Uh, thank you and good night.